Welcome to Missing Hitchhiker. I played the Fears to Fathom game, and I honestly just wanted to play another scary game. So I found this one. It was free. So uh, that's what we're going to be playing. December 11th, 1994. My brother Ethan is missing for around 24 hours. He went on a hiking trip near the Red Mountain. He should have come home yesterday. I went to the local police. They said they don't have the resources for a search right now. So I decided to take matters into my own hands. Oh, we're just in this bitch. And I can drive. Okay. Sick soundtrack. Sick car, bro. Hey, dude, what are you looking for? What do you want? I'm searching for my brother. He went missing while hiking in this area. Sorry to offend you, pal, but that's not my problem. Also, you shouldn't just randomly approach people like this, especially in this area. What do you mean? Hey, look, man. I worked pretty late. I just want to grab some snacks and beers and drive home. I'm not in the mood to talk with people I don't know. I understand. Sorry for bothering you. Alright, dickhead. You annoyed the business guy, achievement. Hey, boss. I'm searching for my brother. He was hiking around this area. He should have come home yesterday. Have you seen him? How does your brother look like? He has brown hair and is pretty tall. He also has a green backpack. Let me think for a second. Hmm, yes, I think I saw your brother. He came in here and bought a few things, some water and a few snacks. Trying to find him? Have you told the police already? Yes, I did, in fact, but they said they don't have the resources for a search right now. They said they only start a search if a person is missing for more than 48 hours. That's not true, by the way. That's a... That's a myth. Uh, if someone's missing... You can just, you can just go tell them, and they'll go look for them. That 48 hours thing is complete bullshit. It isn't the first time someone went missing in this area. At least a handful of people went missing there in the last decade. People talk a lot. I heard rumors that there are strange screams and weird noises coming from the woods. So you should be careful, especially going there at this time of night. There's a road right behind the gas station leading to the mountain. Make sure to stay on it. There could be dangerous wildlife in that area. Thanks, I'll make sure to stay safe. Take care. Yeah, you too, buddy. You too, buddy. Ding dong. So, I mean, do I... Do I car? There's not like a sprint. It's like a, a, a light jog, rather. Yeah, you wouldn't catch me out here at all. To be honest. My brother's tent looks entirely different. I should still take a closer look. That is a tent right there that I didn't even notice. Jesus. Whoa, whoa, who the fuck are you? you? Scared the shit out of me. You, I scared you? I almost had a heart attack myself. What do you want? I hope you're not some kind of pervert or creep. I'm not. I'm searching for my brother. He was hiking in this area. 
Have you seen him? No, but I haven't seen him. Wait. You don't even know how he looks like. Look, man, I'm just some guy that likes to hike in a, in a woods. <laughs> just some guy who likes to hike in a woods and sleep in a tent in freezing conditions. I haven't seen anyone in days. I understand. You planning to go deeper into the forest? Yes, I'll search around the area. I hope I can find uh, my brother, or at least traces of him. Look, you'll probably think I'm a stoner or something. But last night I had my tent a bit up north, and I heard weird noises coming from the woods. It sounded like a child was crying, but I didn't see anything. It creeped me out. Maybe it was a cryptid. A what? Look, man, do you care? What do you mean? I'm talking about a piece, you know? Something for protection? You mean a gun? No, I don't. Then you shouldn't be here in the first place. It's way too dangerous to go deeper into the forest at night. But I'm not going to stop you. I just want to sleep now. Also, one last thing. Don't creep up on a tent in the woods at night ever again. I almost would have shot you. Well, I guess I'm glad you didn't. Me too. Good luck with that search. Dickhead. Wait, wait. I don't know where the trail is. I lost the trail. Never mind. Here it is. God, why did he pop out like that? It scared the shit out of me. Wasn't cool. At all. I don't know how long this game is, or what edits I'm going to do on this. To be honest, it's just kind of one of these things where I wanted to I wanted to try it out. It's been sitting on my computer for a couple of days. And I figured now I could hop in and play it. God, it's so, like, creepy out here. Yeah, I probably should have brought a gun. Who goes in the woods without a gun? Or like some form of weapon. Like I'm at least gonna bring some long knife. Okay. My fingers are pretty much numb. It's hard to build the tent. Fuck yeah. It's a nice tent. Cold, but I'm falling asleep slowly. Buddy, I think you're dying. I think I heard someone scream. I'm not sure if it was real or imagined. I need to check. It could be my brother screaming for help. Oh, dude, just, just, just sleep, man. Just, just stay in the fucking tent. Just stay in the fucking tent. Ah, oh, dude, that's some skinwalker. Just have to stay on the trail, though. Fuck it. We make mistakes in life. And the mistake I'm making right now is not staying on that trail, and I'm cutting through. Yeah, fuck that. I was gonna try to be sneaky, but... I got scared by my own footsteps. I'm too- I'm too much of a pussy for this shit. Way too much of a pussy for this shit. Ah uh, yes, yeah, screaming coming from a little shack in the woods isn't a bad sign at all. And then my light's flickering. Everything's gonna be fine. You know? My brother just decided he wanted to post up here, you know? He's screaming because he's having a great time with some random woman. It's my brother's backpack. <laughs> Right, the backpack is completely empty. Nothing in here. Hello? 
I'm here to talk to you about your car's extended warranty. That's pictures of my tent. Various meats. Oh, you know, bloody table. Generator and a meat hook. I, I, I'm honestly, I'm like kind of, kind of, I'm actually scared. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna sit here and lie and pretend. <laughs> Okay, yeah, we're gonna pretend like I didn't just, I didn't just freeze up and, 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 and didn't flinch so bad that my chest hurts. Yeah, we'll just, yeah, we'll just pretend that, yeah. What the fuck? What the fuck? Well, that was missing hitchhiker. Um. Yeah, that was. I don't know. I don't know how to end this. To be honest, that was. That's that. I guess I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.